Oh, my God, man. Jesus. Let's get back to the thing. Here we go, guys. Lines are open. Here we go. Okay, so this is another one. Do you want to know the real reason why dating nowadays seems like pulling teeth? It seems like it's the most hardest, stressful thing in the world. The men are poor. What? The men are broke. Okay, they don't have it. They don't have it. See, back in the day, because we live under the patriarchy, especially here in America, a man assumed all the entire financial risk of dating oh, back in the day because men had disposable income. Now capitalism is crushing all of us. The men don't have disposable income. So they can't even afford to spend, you know what I'm saying, $40, $50 at the movie with a woman unless they feel like they're 200% sure that it's going to work out. But the reality is you can never be 200% sure without dating that person. Like they're trying to skip steps instead of just acknowledging the fact that they're broke. The average man is truly being priced out of dating. But the thing about men is that men very seldom want to do the work to improve their chances of finding a happy, healthy relationship that meets their standards. Right. They don't want to get better jobs or maybe another job. Capitalism killed oh. all of us. They oh. don't want to uh, reevaluate what's important to them in a woman. They don't want to get a personality. Read a fucking book. Read a book. Have something to talk about when you're talking to women. The men don't have anything to talk about. And they're in denial instead of just yes. accepting all of these yes. things and like doing That's the work. That's true. That's true. To like better position themselves. The men would rather find excuses as to why it's the woman's fault that dating is so hard. That's true. Uh, that's two truths. But no, that's no, 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 no. When it comes Wait, to dating and romance. Can we pause real quick? Okay. So I agree on the two things on the back end, but let's get to the front end. How dare you women say that about men? See, okay. Let's look at it. Let's let's let me. Got it. She said, "I'm with her." I, agree she, with her. I know, I know. I know. That's this is why emotions and logic. Let me give you all some logic, ladies. You wanna, you wanna, a man from the 1950s? Then why don't you dress like a woman in the 1950s? Why don't you submit like a woman in the 1950s? Why don't you know how to shut your mouth like a woman in the 1950s? But instead. You're out here popping your ass, showing your titties, showing your ass cheeks, wearing scandalous ass clothes because you're so insecure that you are augmenting your lips, your forehead, your breast, and your BBL. We don't like that. Men don't like that. Men don't like that. And the thing is, and listen, if you women out here, you women cannot ask. For a real man, if you're fake and fraud and phony, let's talk about that horsey hair. <laughs> that horsey hair. That's not you. You are not those fake floppy eyelashes. You are not that makeup. You are not that push up bra. You are not. So don't, don't, no, man, come on. You can't sit there. Let me just, it's, it's only what, less than 40 seconds. <laughs> All right, let's finish. I'm not done, guys. I got you on this one, guys. Men's relationships, it's always going to be the man's fault. Because the men set the tone. I agree. I hope this was helpful. Um, just to reiterate, dating in 2023 is so hard. Because the men are broke. It's not broke. Okay. It's it's not not it's 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 let me say something about my brothers out here. You never define yourself by your job. Gentlemen, this is how it works. Depending on what you did in school, okay, gentlemen? Depending on how hard you worked, how hard you studied, you know, you're going to get a job based off of your skills. But you are not your skills, gentlemen. So this is what I'm going to defend you guys here. This is why I got my dogs here. 
Don't ever leave with your wallet. Don't let her know what you do for a living and don't make it about money. And the fact that she is making it about money shows how weak her character is because this woman, that woman there has this expectation that you have to have money to have her face in a pillow and her ass up in the air. And that's not true. She gentlemen, let me tell you about these women that they don't want you to know behind that cocky smile of hers behind that fake, whatever hair line, that she put in her hair is a broken, insecure woman that has no self worth, no self identity, and she's broken as hell. So don't let that. We we got a call, but we'll get to this in a second, guys, because I got y'all covered on this. But that's who. That's who you had your meeting. No, no, that's no, no, no. That's crazy. But we got a call. We'll, we'll discuss uh, five seven.